Hey, hey, all you brewmasters. Welcome to Brew Pub Simulator. Yes, I am first Quasar, your brewmaster for this evening. And we are getting ready to jump into a brand new game. Now, we have played this in Playtest. Um, this is the demo. So this is a little bit more of an extension of what we played earlier. And it does have a few new items in it. So I'm kind of excited to actually jump in here and see what they have to do or what they've created and what they've expanded on. Let's see, have you ever dreamed about swimming in a pool of full beer? Hmm, yes. All right, so much like in the play test, we have this lawyer that's basically given us this place because of our grandfather, I believe. Here we are at last, let's not delay any longer. Would you mind spelling your name? I need to put it in for paperwork. So we're gonna put our name in. Um, Hurst Quasar, Q-U-A-Y-Z-A-R. There we go. I am male, accept. All right, excellent. So Mr. Hurst Quasar, your grandfather decided that the bar will be passed on to a family member who is able to meet all his requirements. As far as I'm concerned, you are you are the only one eligible. Now, what scares me about this is says, I'm the only one eligible. Which means to tell me there was others. <laughs> so there could have been others out there. And tell me, are you ready for the grand opening? Yes, I am. Of course, you're not ready. Take a look around. The place is a mess. Uh, first of all, let's clean it up. All right. So a uh, big thing is, is that you pick up the table. You hit the control. You can rotate these bad boys with the mouse. So... Trying to get that, there we go. So you get it, control to rotate it, and you can slide them into place, there we go. So it took me a little bit to understand the, the controls on this, to be honest with you, because it's really different from what I'm used to. So yeah. All right, so one day you'll redecorate this place, but for now, let's get rid of the broken stuff. You got it. So let's get rid of all this stuff. It should be enough. Did you get the package? Uh, what package? Go to the back door, big cardboard box. Uh, wait at your driveway, open it. Now check this out. This is like a back room alley place, man. Here's our package. All right, uh, now go to the kitchen. You have the ingredients to brew your first beer. It's a simple recipe. I'm sending it to you right now. Okay, good luck with your first beer. Thanks. We will continue tomorrow. All right, so we've got an American Pale Ale that we've got going on. So I have to press I to get everything out. Now, because I've done this before, I know exactly what's going on. Um, press I. We've got the yeast. Uh, we have the hops. And then we have the light malt. All right. So now we need to figure out our recipes. We'll come down here, grab a recipe. This is our American Pale Ale. It tells us exactly how to do this. So yeah, we are ready to go. I got nine bucks to my name, people. Did you see that? Nine bucks. All right, first things first, we need some water. So we need what? 5.3 liters, so. That's pretty close, right? 5.3 liters, 5.25. So I think that's good enough, right? Uh, oh man, it is not gonna let me do anything less than three point. So there we go. I've got 5.52. So it's gonna be a weak, a weak batch, I guess. Uh, come on. Uh, why can I get this? Ah, uh, come on. Jesus. Okay, let's get rid of this. Because that's not what I want in it. Okay, let's... Throw it over there. Get rid of it. <laughs> that's how we got it. That's how I get rid of it. All right, let's try this again. All right. This controls are still a little, little off for me. Okay. There we go. We've got that. Now light malt. 
we need to put in, gotta aim it in here. We need to put in what? Light malt is 1.30 liters. So you can definitely get it, um, you can pour it a little bit more up here. There we go. We adjusted it. Let's see here. Can I get down to one meter? Yeah. Yeah, I want to try to get it to 1.3 meter. Uh, 1.3 liters. So I knocked it down a little bit, so I'm not going over. But yeah, I could have adjusted it a little bit better than what I have. I got five milliliters in there. It's still coming up fairly. Oh, okay. It's coming up a little quicker. Okay. Five liters it is. Uh... Okay, I put it in there. How much? One point. Okay. Yeah, I, I mean, I put exactly that amount in there. There we go. I guess we just had to go over. All right. Um, now the bag with hops. Okay, we want 10 grams of it. So we'll adjust that up to 10 grams. Boom, we got it. All right. Uh, let me turn these things around. There we go. All right, turn on the stove. Fire this bad boy up and let's get the brewing. Now I hear that this process is actually kind of stinky, actually. Uh, I've never done it before. So it's, I would be interested if any of you are brewmasters out there, if you have done it before and does it stink? I would like to know. Um, I thought about doing it myself just, just for fun, just for fun. Um, Come on. Um, but, you know, I, I don't know. We need the yeast. Okay, so we're gonna bring this puppy up to 100 degrees Celsius. And we're gonna boil for 60 minutes. Right? Yeah. So if ever you're looking for it, you can look over here on the side to get what's coming up. I turn it off to cool it off to 21, add five grams of the American yeast then transfer to the bucket. So yeah, that's exactly what we're gonna end up doing. And then we will have our first batch of First Quasar's American Pale Ale. Yes, HQAPA, gotta have it. All right, 60 minutes is up. Let's turn off the stove. So yeah, a few things that have changed. Um, the hoses are a little bit better, definitely. Uh, for the most part, back here, everything seems to be the same. I can't still get in here. I don't know what that's going to be, but uh, that's fine. All right, now we're down to 21 degrees Fahrenheit, degrees Celsius, I should say. Oh, I need to bag the yeast. Okay, let's, I'm going to put five, five grams in it. Um, this is milliliters. Okay, so that's a little bit different. Okay, so that's... <laughs> okay, so we do have a little bit of a problem there. Five grams and five liters is two totally different things. All right, we're gonna pick up the big pot. We are going to take it over here and we're gonna pour it into our bucket. There we go. Yeah, there we go. All of it in there. All right. That back on the stove. Put the lid on this bad boy, and we need to ferment. Ah, so not too bad. Not too bad for our first batch. What do you think? Not too bad at all. Okay, so this is where we've actually we've got a five out of five. So cool. We're gonna edit it. We are gonna make this uh, an HQ. Uh, we'll just put it a quasar. APA. Okay, and then we get to edit the label. This is like one of the things I like the most about this. Okay, so my logo, do want my logo to be green. My ribbon, I wanna change it up a little bit. I want that ribbon. Uh, the ribbon, of course, I want to have. Uh, 
maybe yellow background being orange yeah i think that's what we're gonna do right there uh ribbon a little bit yellow background a little bit orange this kind of goes with my 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 logo right my my qq my quasar's quest logo so yeah there we go confirm and now we can edit the price as well so we can like adjust this up a little bit yeah 520 that works for me ah <laughs> yeah there we go all right so now we've done that good morning miss quasar got a glimpse of your bar on the way this on not bad not bad at all hope that the beer will match the decor's quality and look oh wait a minute no we don't have it in there yet um a friend of mine will visit you today are you ready for your first client what of course i am no you're not you need to put the beer in the kegs do you plan this straight from the do i plan to serve it straight from the pot well yes i am basically because that's just the way i am all right so still you have to put this higher than the keg to transfer so make sure you re realize that got the connection going transferred okay so we've got that we'll disconnect the hose we're gonna connect we're gonna look at this take a look at this look at look i've got my label right there yeah baby yeah baby i wish you could keep the label straight up but it won't won't do it for me all right all right connected all right and we're gonna put our bucket back over here take the lid off that let it air out okay we've got the the keg connected to the shank and um yeah we've got uh oh this is i didn't i didn't go in order i didn't go in order so here we go look at the keg look at the shank boom 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 done now i can put it on the menu right remember we had to put this on the menu so so far what has changed is the label the labeling so the quasar apa is on there Woo -hoo. now i can close the window got a new recipe for the american black ale which is cool now you need to order some glasses um we'll go ahead and grab uh we'll get the tea grab some glasses order those bad boys up uh they are in my inventory what's good about this is they used to have to put all the glasses in one at a time this you just throw them right in there bam done yes i am ready haha -ha, this time you are ready all right just smile and be nice to your customers your expectations won't be too high right now you are just at the beginning of your entrepreneur journey after all good luck thank you very much here we go we are opening up our pub so considering uh so far it's been actually pretty pretty smooth so far I got a jukebox over here playing some music oh we've got our first you don't even look like uh you are old enough to have beer young lady what's your preference the quasar apa you got it girl so my problem was i kept trying to put it down here the problem i just have to put it right at the at the tap now if you're not careful you will overflow these things see how you did that and then i have to put it right there there we go now the other added thing is that you can clean the bar okay uh customer's bark is worse than their bite good huh okay so what would you like to have young man you cleaned up the space now you know how to brew you can handle the customers great okay let's move to the next grandfather's wishes restore the former glory of this pub all right see when things got worse your grandpa sold part of his pub he kept doing it until he left with what you see right now i've managed to contact current owners of the part neighboring oh they're willing to sell so we're gonna so get 30 dollars, and i will get on the paperwork okay good luck call me when you're ever you're ready apa you got it bro so this is the deal i gotta get 30 bucks Let's see if he he's happy good deal so a number one, please. A number one, okay. Why can't I grab my glass? There we go. So yeah, I kept having problems with this. There we go. I don't fill it up too much because 
it overflows and then I have to clean the bar again. Okay. So not too bad. Serving them up. You got it, another APA for you. Quasar APA seems to be quite popular. Okay, somebody's left their glass there. There you go. All right, so now let's grab some glasses. Clean these bad boys up. Okay. Hang on one second, young lady, young lad. Let me clean this place up a little bit. Hey, hey, hope you guys are enjoying the beer. Glad you are. Okay, so what would you like? You got it. Number one, please. So, as, as you know, it's because it, I only have one, I guess. I guess it's a good thing I know what the number one is. There you go. Glass is cleaned up. Get a couple of these done. I want to make sure I've got this place as cleaned up as possible. Okay. Hey, customer rated me a four out of five. That's cool. Thanks for that. Definitely appreciate it. Need more tables in here. These guys are crowding around this one table. All right. Clean up what we can. Hey, how you doing, young lady? Yep, you don't look like you could be uh, over 21. That's okay. I'll give you the beer anyway. Uh, you, there you go. Oop, I made a mess. Jeez. Okay, so far I'm trying to keep up on everything. We got people coming in here. I'm trying to keep my glasses clean. No one else is in here yet. Maybe I got a chance to up shop here. Yeah, I don't see anybody else coming in, so I might be in good shape. We have how much we got? We got 49 bucks. Yes. I don't know how much beer we have left. Ah. I got 2.05 liters, so I've got enough to get uh, enough enough for a couple more beers here, it looks like. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Ah, tried to clean that spot. There we go. Hey, got another customer in here. Grab myself a... Okay. Go one beer for you, young lady. Okay, how much we have left in here? 1.38 liters. So we've so we've got uh, we've got a lot here. Yes, sir. APA, please. Yep, you got it. Oh, spilt a little. Jeez. Okay, so how much I got left? Eight. So 430. If I shortchange this guy, 430, right? So watch what I do. I'm going to shortchange this guy. I'll give him four. I'll give him 440, right? He's going to be mad. 
I have to pay for a full amount of beer when I only get part of it. Um, I'm trying to empty out what I have left. I got one more beer I could probably serve, and that's about it. Um, not that I care what you think of my pub, because I am doing my best here. Getting as much money out of it as possible. Now, actually doing it at the four, at the, you know, 490 milliliters um, that actually probably helped out a little bit too oh ooh I unlocked a bar stool nice all right all right we got through that day all right so let's I'm going to, what I'm going to do is get this, get this all cleaned up before I get anything going any farther because I need, I am just, I am the person that just needs to have everything. Oh, okay. Is it dirty? Maybe I need to clean it. Ah, maybe it was a little dirty. Maybe that's what the problem was. Okay. Let's go clean up my uh, messes out here. All right. So, yeah, so much for a pretty good day, right? I made 70 bucks out of that batch. It's not too bad. Let's go ahead and close the shop up. Okay. Don't let the customer be disappointed. Lord, 30 bucks. Hmm. Okay, so we got to purchase the upgrade via the tablet. So let's open up the tablet. Uh, we're looking at the upgrade. Expands the bar area, unlocks new items, increases the client limit. Ooh, nice. Okay, so... Can't buy an upgrade while the bar is open. I just cl closed it. Okay, I've closed it. I, I, th I swear I just closed it, right? Okay, so there, there. Upgrade. Ooh, boom, knocked out that wall. Nice. All right. Uh, brewery upgrade, which is going to cost me 50 bucks. I don't have the, I don't have the money for that right now. Ooh, I've got an arcade game. Just got confirmation from your bank. Everything is set. Round table. Nice. Humera? Oh, okay. So I don't remember having this. The last time chairs okay what is this I got something spilled down there I did wow interesting okay all right however I have the hired ninja multitaskers group to remove the wall separating the two sides of the building they are extraordinarily skillful and I highly recommend them See for yourself. Yeah. Nice. Should be done. How do you like your new space? Wow. So spacious. Indeed. You know how to use a shopping app? Look around for some entertainment. You don't want this pub to be just be a drink and go, do you? All right. So. Let's open up the tablet. Let's look for decorations, I guess. Uh, mini games. Supplies. Tools. Decorations. Okay. Mini games. So. Arcade game, twenty bucks. Yeah. So let's go ahead and get that puppy. Uh, okay. So in my inventory, I've got the arcade game, right? Should be able to place that bad boy. Ooh, can't get too close there, can I? Okay. Got the arcade game going. Oh, I remember when your grandpa bought this first arcade machine. We were playing for hours. In fact, he forgot he opened the bar that day. <laughs> uh, all right, so don't let any customer be disappointed. Interesting. Okay, more fun activities will affect the duration of your customer's visits. Keep them entertained and money will flow. Okay, uh, speaking of money, if you think seriously about your business growth, we shall discuss making adjustments in the brewing section. You will need a way to more space for the ingredients and utensils. We have to prepare for another expansion. Whenever you will be ready, collect $50, and I will con contact Ninja Multitaskers once again. 
All right. So I have a couple of things. Let's see, I got 20 bucks. What is in this tab? Decorations, uh, furnishings. Um, tables, 10. Bar stools are five. Let's try to get two. Let's get two bar stools, right? I want to put the bar stools right here, I think. I'm hoping so anyway. So in my inventory, I should have two bar stools, right? Let's go one there. And can I put one right there? Yeah, I can put one right there. All right, so we have a Oh, wait a minute. This guy doesn't seem like he wants to be there. Um, hang on. Do I have to rotate him around? I think so. Okay. There we go. That's what it is. Okay. Okay. I'm going to rotate this guy. Belly up. Hey, man. Let's put him over here. go yes I think I want to put both of them over here actually so let's go ahead and put this guys back over here all right a couple bar stools I think that's cool um, I'm running low on money I've only got 10 bucks so I think that's gonna be our ticket right now all right uh, what is the blackened ale so we're just gonna look We'll get the black ale. Um, let's see, new. Uh, what do I need for this? I need water, light malt extract, uh, chocolate malt, magnum hops, and American Yale, American ale yeast. So let's pin that for right now. Maybe we'll try this. Um, this doesn't tell me. I've got 195 milliliters of the yeast. So that's good. I've got enough yeast. Uh, Cascade hops, and I need magnum hops, light malt extract. Uh, how much do I need that? Don't have enough of that. So what I need to do is buy some supplies. I need light malt extract. Oh, yikes. Ah, uh, yeah, I spent money on that. The other is the uh, 10 bucks, 10 bucks. Okay, hang on. Can I? Okay, can't. Ah, uh, man. Okay, so how am I going to do this? I think what I'm going to end up doing is... Probably making another batch. I think I'm gonna have to make another batch of this stuff. So, okay, so let's go. Uh, light malt extract, I'm gonna have to get that. Okay, so I've got that. Um, we're gonna have to make another batch of this, of the uh, Quasar. So let's go to my recipes here. We want to go back up to my American Pale Ale. Let's pin that. Um, all right, so the light malt extract. Light malt extract. We'll dump in everything we have here. I don't think I have enough actually, so. Yep, not enough greens. Okay, so I don't know what I'm gonna do with this, right? I know what I'm gonna do with it. Can I throw it away? No. But I bet I can toss it way over there. <laughs> yes, I can. All right. Uh, in my inventory, I should have another one of these bad boys. Okay. Um, so that's 1.9. 
Let's go ahead and back this off a little bit. That's 130. That's close to 130, so we'll see how that plays out. Kind of cheaping out on the on the ingredients here. Cascade hops. Bring out the hops. Alright, we need 10 grams of those. So let's 10 grams. Boom. Done. Yep. Then we bring this bad boy to a boil, right? So this is where I get mixed up. Okay. Turn it on, boil. Yep. Okay. Right. So we got that. We got our keg. Oh, we've got our keg that still has something in it. Hmm. So what I'm going to have to do is I've got to take everything out. We didn't get a second second person in. So yeah, now we're empty. There we go. Wipes out my keg. Clean that up. Alright, where are you at? 30 minutes into the boiling process, so here we go. So yeah, so far so good. This hasn't been uh, too, too bad. I do like the label process. I love that. Okay, so don't let any customer be disappointed. That's an extra 30 bucks if I can get that. I can sell items, but I don't have anything actually to sell. Okay, 60 minutes, boom, you're done. Let you cool down to 90. And then what do I need to do here? Uh, five grams. So what I'm going to do with this, because it does say five grams, what I am going to do, let's see if I can. Yeah, we're going to put five in. And actually what we're going to do is put one more in just for the fun of it. Pour this in. Yes. Get you back over here. Lid on you. Ah. Now we gotta wait for it. Gotta wait for it to uh, ferment. So what I need to do just to do that is like open and then close the bar. leave ah <laughs> american pale ale all right so it is ready i don't have it so, yeah got that it's got the hq pale ale again hq apa my label i wish we could keep the labeling that's the thing i would like to keep most of all okay the ribbon was going to be yellow and the background was going to be orange. There we go. Confirm. Confirm. I did not. Oh, wait a minute. Um, needed to change the price on that. I forgot to change the dang price. Okay, so let's do that. That. Disconnect. Put you back over here. Plug the lid off. Uh, done. All right. Now I gotta put this on. Uh, I need to edit it. Uh, I want to bump the price up a little bit. Okay, it is on, is it on the menu? No, add it to the menu, close. Okay, there we go. Now we've got it. All right, let's open up our shop. Let's get some money in here because we've down to like 65 cents. I have nothing. 
Um, and it's going to cost me 50 to open that up over there. So I'm really, really not even happy about that, to be quite honest with you. Just give you a beer, huh? All right, honey. Guess you've had a long day, huh? There you go. APA for you, you got it. go yeah what can I do for you APA for you as well gotcha come on got to figure out this whole glass situation come on okay there you go Let me clean up the bar here Needed more glasses is what I needed. Oh, 470, you're probably not gonna like that. Ah, he's somewhat happy. Give you any beer, you got it. There we go. APA for you. And there you go. All right, where'd your glasses go, people? I saw you sitting over here. Did they take them home with them? <laughs> Jeez. Okay. I don't know where all the glasses went. That's interesting. I've lost glasses. Yes, sir. What can I get for you? An APA? You got it. Are you here for the entertainment? I do have a... I do have a... Video game over there. It used to be the time when I would go to the arcade and dump 20 bucks worth of quarters into Asteroids. My, my, my game I liked to play was Asteroids. So, yeah. What was your games you liked to play? Yep, after school, at night. Yeah, um, why do I pay for a full amount of beer when I only get part of it? What? So at least nine beers. Okay, I've got, jeez. And I'm giving you guys, I'm giving you guys top, top choice here. Okay, so I gotta figure out. Ah, oh, these clowns. Okay, hang on guys. These guys over here decided to schmoosh me on the on the on the glasses. All right, there you go. Yeah, this isn't this is going I'm <laughs> trying to go as quick as I can. Um, I gave you a full beard there, young lady. I don't know what your problem is, to be quite honest with you. You can go carry yourself to the next bar for all I care. All right. Can't believe that. Okay, so everybody that sat over here glasses are like no respect man no respect at all yeah go play a video game or something okay how much money I got I got 93 bucks sweet so that helps I can expand but I won't have team money for ingredients to serve more beer so this is the deal right 
I'm going to have to figure out my best course of action from here. Hey, I think this is going to be it. I think you are, you two are going to be my last customers for the evening. I can't believe they left these glasses all over the place. This is just rude. Okay, so you want a beer too? I've got only a little bit. Oh my gosh. I'm looking at the wrong one, almost. Okay. All right. Okay. Sorry, but I'm gonna have to close the shop down. Oh, got a nice tall round table. Got plus 71 bonus. That's nice. Uh, okay, so I didn't get the 30 bucks. Keep doing this level under 50%. Uh, jeez. I tried. Man, I did try. But it's time for me to clean up shop here. I do have... Get, I'm going to have to move my bar stool out. You're kidding me, right? Okay, so that's kind of wrong. Hey, I've got four glasses. <laughs> I've lost two along the way. Oh my gosh, I think they're gone. I think... That's just wrong. All right, so I've lost a couple glasses. So there you go. I'm gonna have to do something. Um, I need to clean up over here, it looks like. I got some stuff underneath here. Clean that up. Clean that up. Do I have anything underneath there? I think I am good. I think I'm good. All right, so out here is not a whole lot yet. Great. From what I remember, I paid a full amount. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, expand the brewery. Purchase the, yeah, the tablet. Didn't want to spend that, but okay. Brewery. 50 bucks. Upgrade. Watch this. Boom. It's been blown out. So now we've got all kinds of stuff going on here. Nice. All right, we have 56 bucks. We have new chairs. That's nice. Ficus. Oh, ho, ho. I have beaten the demo. Brace yourself for the full game. Yes. All right, so there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is Brew Pub Simulator. All right, so one of the, some things that have happened since the playtest. One was um, you have to wash, clean up the bar. Uh, anything that's spilled, you have to clean it up. That's that's new. The label, I knew it was coming, but that, I, I love it. What I would like to have is that you keep it that way. Especially if it, you know, if it, if you just be a way to attach it to the beer that you brew. That would be nice. All right. So that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for hanging with me. Thanks for having a beer with me. I'll talk to you brewmasters later. This is Hurst Quasar saying goodnight, everyone. And uh, I'm out.